Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Welcome to the 9 p.m. live English news edition. Here are the headlines. Close meeting with representatives of the unit, unity regions. Catastrophic flood after sailing's passage over the southern, uh, southeastern United States. Hello, welcome to our newsroom for having the news in uh, details. The President of the Republic, His Excellency Mr. Ismail Omar Ghali, today, Thursday, wished a success and prosperity to the new Japanese Prime Minister, Mr. Yoshihide Suga, elected yesterday. In a congratulatory uh, telegram sent to the new uh, Japanese head of government, uh, President Ghali uh, praised, uh, praised uh, uh, a resounding victory, uh, a guarantee of massive support from the uh, Japanese people for the uh, political leadership of Mr. Yoshihide Suga. Your perfect knowledge of your country's issues and political uh, pragmatism and characterizes you will serve as a precious support to lead the friendly nation of Japan towards greater progress, prosperity and fulfillment, wrote the head of state. The Republic of Djibouti shares a long relationship and of friendship and cooperation as well as strategic partnership with the state of Japan. The President of the Republic was also pleased to note in this message the readiness of the government and people of Djibouti to work to strengthen these already privileged ties. Now, in the country, a delegation led by the uh, President of the National Assembly, Mohammed Ali Mohammed, visited the Dikhil region yesterday afternoon. The delegation was composed of several members of the government, namely the Minister of Budget, Abdul Karim al the Chair, that of the Environment and Native of the Region of Dikhil, uh, Mohammed Moussa Abdul Ghadir Halim, that of uh, Decentralization, Aramis, the Sultan of uh, Gobad, Habib Boko, the Director uh, General of the Radio Television, Djibouti, Mohammed Suleiman Harid, and the several senior officials of the Public Administration. Arriving at the spot, the delegation met with the notables and occults of the region of Dikhil. Several teams focused on the socio-economic development and the current, uh, the, uh, current problems of the Dikhil region were on the menu of discussion between the delegation led by the President of the Assembly and the authorities and representative of the unity region. The Prefect of the Region and the President of the Regional Council first of all welcomed the delegation led by Mohammed uh, Ali uh, Hamid, uh, President of the National Assembly. After a word of welcome, the uh, Prefect of the Region and the President of the Regional Council together outlined the major development advances uh, to, uh, that the region of Dikhil has experienced in recent years in industry, agricultural, among others. He spoke first. The President of the National Assembly, Ali, uh, Muhammad Ali Muhammad, said he was help. very pleased with the welcome reserved for him and his delegation. President Muhammad Ali Muhammad said that this visit is part of our policy of proximity with the Jewish people. He also recalled that the uh, role played by the Parliament for the monitoring and evaluation of development programs. Proximity meeting organized in Dikhil is very important for the success of development programs which aim at improving the lives of our citizens. The President of the Assembly congratulated the Minister of the, uh, uh, of the Region for all the efforts made to find solution in consultation with the local population. Moreover, the President stressed that all the projects are valid and at the level of the Parliament which has the task of monitoring and evaluation. Now the budget minister uh, spoke in his turn and indicated that this meeting will not be the last. He also stated that the purpose of the, his visit was to hear the grievances of his fellow citizens. Now it was time for debates and questions. The notables in Ocals in turn welcomed the President of the National Assembly, Mohammed Ali Muhammad, and his delegation. Then uh, they expressed their satisfaction with the services provided by the government and that they are confident for the future. Now, Mr. Hamadou Aramis, Secretary, uh, State Secretary for Decentralization, stressed that recently the uh, President of the Republic, His Excellency Mr. Ismail Margheli, had toured the five regions of the, reg of the interior and had held consultation and proximity meetings without intermediaries with the representatives of the people. Following this tour, he gave firm instruction to all members of the government for a rapid and effective response to the grievances raised in the regions. With regard to decentralization, we are, we are, are going to launch a major project for all the five regions in collaboration 
with the elective representative of each region. So uh, said Mr. Aramis, the population of the regions will participate in all stage of the project to ensure the success of the project we are going to launch. This is the objective of the uh, political process of decentralization implemented by, by to strengthen the participation of the regions in the implementation project that we are going to uh, launch. Finally, uh, Mr. Aram is thanking the population for the welcome given to the joint delegation from the parliament and the government. Still, the ba budget minister of the economy has shared the minister of, of uh, environment and the uh, minister of decentralization all thanked the Ocarians for the warm welcome. Uh, they uh, then answered questions from the regions, notables, and occults. Now the mediator of the French Republic accompanied by two high-ranking officials of his department and the members of parliament of the uh, region of Tadra, where uh, they were joined by the uh, prefect of and the representative of the region of the regional council, where a memorandum of understanding was signed between different parties. With these protocols, the uh, participants expressed their wish to unite their strength in order to find a lasting solution to be to the uh, various issues that may arise when uh, meeting uh, the uh, citizens. The mediators of Djibouti underline that this is an uh, exogenous of the uh, President of the Republic always concerned about the well-being of his population to have a close approach so that high citizens of Djibouti can find his rights or that he is on the national uh, territory. Now within the uh, framework of uh, the celebration of the International Day for the Protection of the Ozone Layer, the Ministry of Town Planning, Environment and Tourism organized this morning in the uh, conference room of the uh, General Directorate of Customs a training workshop for custom of officers on the control of the important substances that deplete the ozone layer. The objective of this workshop is to train customs officials and other agents on the control of uh, import ozone depleting substances and learning of uh, and learning uh, mastery of techniques for the detection of ozone depleting substances. The opening ceremony of this workshop was chaired by Mr. Dini Abdullah Omar, General Secretary uh, to the Ministry of Urban Planning, Environment and Tourism. The training workshop was attended by the uh, Director of the Environment and Sustainable Development, Mr. Uh, Hussein Rirash Roble, Deputy Director General of Customs and Indirect Duties, Mr. Idris Abdi Talan, and the National Coordinator of the Ozone Project, Mr. Idris Ismail. This workshop is part of the final management plan of hydrochlorocarbon and allows us to equip our customs officials with all necessary knowledge to better control and monitor ozone depleting substances at the national level. Now the Chief of the uh, General Staff of the Armed Forces, Lieutenant General Zakaria Sheikh Ibrahim, received this morning at, the, uh, at 9 uh, o'clock in his office at the General uh, Staff of the Army Forces, Air uh, Brigadier General Stephen Dupont, the new commander of the French Forces stationed in Djibouti. General Stephen Dupont took command of Comfort on 1st September 2020. During uh, his military career, General uh, Stephen Dupont has already spent time in Djibouti from uh, 20, uh, 2010 and 2012 as commander of FFDG Air Base 188. Welcomed on the staff's stoop with honors by Colonel Ubadi Jam Musa, head by Regimental Headquarters Corps. General Stephen went to the office of the uh, General uh, this first visit by Comfort. Uh, uh, General uh, Stephen uh, Dupont was to make contact with Djiboutian uh, General. Lieutenant Colonel Mohamed uh, Qayyad Naji, uh, CMG Chief of Staff, took part in this visit. In his speech, General Zakaria Sheikh Ibrahim first welcomed the new Comfort for his second, second visit to Djibouti in uh, a land of exchange and meeting. CMG stressed the exceptional strong ties between Djibouti and France, particularly in the military field, which must be further strengthened in the common interests of our two countries. The Tribution CMG assured General Stefan Dupont of his absolute support and that of his staff in the accomplishment pardon, of his mission. For his part, General Stephen Dupont thanked the warm welcome extended to him. The new comfort is committed to uh, work harder to strengthen, consolidate, and burden uh, these ties of cooperation. This first contact visit ended with a traditional uh, family uh, photo.
Now elections in Balbala. The election of the uh, president of the municipality of Balbala were held this morning in the sub-prefecture of the 5th district in accordance with the uh, legislation in force. Two candidates were in the running. Ali Samatar Saeed and Mr. Idris Bashir, the elected representative of the Balbala Commune, mobilized massively to take part in this election. This ceremony saw the participation of the uh, prefect of the city of Djibouti, Osman Abile, uh, the judicial officer, and the elected representatives of uh, Balbala Commune who uh, voted massively for their candidate. After counting uh, in the uh, ballot boxes, the candidate Idris Bashir Gura won the vote 24 votes against 20 with 54% of the votes cast and thus become the new president of uh, Balbala Commune. Once again, the uh, national gendarmerie has put an end to uh, the uh, malicious schemes of drug traffickers whose sole aim is to incite all youth to uh, debauchery by introducing them to the use of drugs and to make easy money. With this in mind, on 16 September 2020, uh, at around 2 p.m., the gendarmes of the uh, 6 7 neighborhood brigade set up a supervised transaction operation aimed at arresting a trafficker wholesaler of narcotics project who attended to set up his illegal businesses near to middle school in Humboldt. The presumed trafficker entered the system already put in place by the investi investigators and a vehicle used as a taxi and accompanied by his two faithful companions. The three traffickers were immediately arrested. The search carried out on the vehicle led to the discovery initially of eight cups of cannabis herb. The gendarmes then searched the vehicle's hiding place in the industrial zone where 16 other cups were found. A total of uh, 24 cups of cannabis herb weighing a total of 2 kilograms and with a market value of 192,000 uh, 192, uh, francs jewelry. At the end of the investigation, the three traffickers will be brought to justice to answer for the action as for the vehicle used to transfer the illicit uh, goods has been detained at the 67 uh, Brigade. The National Gendarmerie undertakes to continue on this path and to eradicate any criminal interference that harms the future of our youth and consequently that of our uh, country. Now, the acting uh, prefect of Dekhil received last Monday a large quantity of agriculture project consisting with dozens of boxes filled with seeds and containing each box more than 700 bags of seeds and watering kits for the drip watering system pipes for the hand drip system about the new regional the Ministry of Agriculture so uh, uh, agriculture's sub-director uh, in Dekhil, Mr. Ali uh, Muhammad Ali, who, who the projects are attended for the farmers of different cooperatives in the region of Dekhil. The reception ceremony took place at the residence uh, of the uh, prefecture in the presence of, uh, of the acting prefect, Mr. Uh, Yusuf Ali, and all the president and members of different cooperative for this purpose, Deputy Prefect Tang, the Directorate of the Agriculture. Moving on to international news, a catastrophic flus, power cuts, and one death are the hot balance sheet of the American authorities after Hurricane Sally hit southeastern United States. In, uh, in Pensacola, Florida, the uh, streets were submerged by torrential rains battered by winds of up to 165 km per hour, 165 meters per hour. At least 370 people had to be rescued. Blocked by rising, raising uh, waters, one family was found in a tree. More than 540,000 homes were without power in Alabama and Florida this morning. This is it for this edition of 9 p.m. Thank you for watching us and have a wonderful evening.